I want to find the center, the foci, and the vertices of this ellipse, and then I'll finally graph it. So starting off here uh, for the center, it's going to be 3, negative 1. And then for my, fo uh, my foci, or actually my vertices, uh, this part you got to be a little bit careful about. Uh, my It's going to be with my major axis, which is going to be uh, 3. So it's going to be... Um, it's going to be shifted up, uh, up and down three. So what you do is it's going to be, uh, so it's going to be uh, with respect to my center. So it's going to be three, and then you you subtract for the bottom one. You subtract three from this, so it's negative four, and then for the top one it's three, and then you add three, so it becomes two. For my foci. Uh, real quick, it's just going to be the square root of uh, 9 minus 4. And what you're going to do is you're going to add this to the se center component, square root of 5. So you're going to get 3, and then you're going to get negative 1 minus root 5. And then you're going to get 3, uh, negative 1 plus root 5. All right, so now we want to go ahead and graph it. I'll go ahead and graph it here. So 3... Negative one's our center. Vertices are at uh, two. Negative. Oops, I made a mistake there. This should be two, and this should be negative four. And then for a minor axis, it's just two. All right. And I still gotta draw the foci in here. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> Roughly something like that. Yeah, just ignore that. Let's see here. Ah. Yeah, good enough. Um, all right, so our foci will be somewhere up in here. All right, and that's it.